getting gas right now, man. All that negativity. Leaving the tank. It's windy too out here, man. It's a beautiful day. That's why I love my birthday season, bro. My birthday season really be. First cut, about to go get the car washed. Um car washed. Get a smoothie or something like that and then go from there. Talking to the wifey right now. Say what up, wifey. Hey. But uh yeah, I'm trying to she went to take the little one to the doctor, man. She be congested and nose running and stuff like that. So she been trying to make sure she was straight. Um so she's good. She's got a kind of one of them things where she just gotta ride it out. Let me get with y'all. Look at this stain on my shirt. Can't do white tees. We're in the car. He made it to We're me. We're in the vehicle. Drop my car off. I dropped my car off to get washed. So it got washed. That's the type of stuff this place by high crib do. Like they be having such a long wait time. Uh -huh. You gotta drop the car off. You know what I'm saying? So. Yeah, but it's cool though, you know, because I came and I scooped my baby up. Scooped? <laughs> Her baby. We might as well get something to eat because we're starving. And then uh, we get the kids to school after that. Well, and then by then, his car should be ready. Hopefully. Last time they said an hour and a half, it took him like two hours. You have to take an Uber back to the house. Remember that? Well, I don't <laughs> think it was that. I think it was we had something to do. And but it I didn't still know it was, was like, take them that but long. But remember, it was like, a, it was like but almost we was, two hours. But we wasn't expecting it to be that long. Nigga, they didn't say now, that. At least now I'm expecting it to take a while, but we had something to do and I didn't know it was gonna be that long. And I had to go do something at the crib, so I had to go Uber back to the crib, mm -hmm. uh, handle that, and then I think I hopped in your car mm -hmm. or something like that. Yeah, you took my car. Cause we was in one car that day. But, but today we, we both our cars, so. And now we, we know, we're gonna we get some deep uh, cleaning on the, Oh yeah, it's gonna be a while. The carpet, I didn't do the interior stuff because I can do that. It's the carpet that's really been. Mm -hmm. Needing some TLC. Well, that's good. They're going to do, the gonna do what they time. need to do and make it work. So, it's all that matters. Yes, ma'am. So, we catch y'all in the vision. Yeah, well, once we get the kiddos and all that. Man, you, you look cute. Oh, oh. Really? I'm going to make up on her nothing. On I look bait. dead in the face. But hey, you never look dead. It's cool. You are alive. You hear me? You know, I am. Girl, look Who's, at yourself. You be happy. You got to recognize. You be happy. You yeah. do. That's my man. You got to recognize. It's so cute. I, I ain't married to no dead in the face person. You're right. You're not. Speak I mean, I just, right. I have, I said a moment. I no. trust and believe. I know I look good, but right. it's That's the, you know, it's the even moment. Your moment. Even your moment, even your best moments is your best moment. I know I'm best ain't the word, but you know what I'm saying. Yeah. You get me? Mm -hmm, I get you. We'll be back, y'all, because we're about to go eat. Bye-bye. In the store real quick, about to pick up a few items before we do what we got to do. So, yeah, man. Let me do my little shop. I know I'm, I'm all over the place. So many other little things I gotta be doing right now before this event tomorrow. Got little mama, of course, covered up right now. I think she's asleep. But uh, yeah, Quanisha left me. She went to go get her something to eat. And you know her, she need her food now. And I know we was, was supposed to, but we decided to go ahead and hit up a restaurant um, when the kids get out of school. So. You know, they all wait. They all can eat something too. So, I'm going to holler back at y'all in a moment. All right. So, me and wifey uh, end up finding a, a pretty cool gift. <clears throat> um, so, my idea was, the uh, reason why I went to Target, uh, I've been trying to figure out something to, to give out to the person who came the furthest uh, to our wrestling uh, watch party. And, um, you know, you guys are amazing. Our subscribers and stuff like that. So, I have been thinking about this for quite some time. Um, I'm glad I was able to do the shirts. That was live. Uh, so now we're gonna be selling those. And of course, you guys are gonna be the first ones to be able to buy merch from yeah, us. And be able to rock them. Yeah, and rock them before anybody else. So I'm finna actually get ready to start promoting that now. Mm -hmm. um, and then I was like, man, what about, cause we know we got a couple people flying in. Some people are, Mm -hmm. you know driving you know so forth whether they're getting hotels rental cars all this stuff so i was like you know what the least i could do is try to give something back to the person who came the furthest and we found some some dope headphones some beats i actually wanted them to be honest with you so that's the type of gift giver i am if i want it then i'm like mm -hmm. 
all right, it'll probably be dope for that person. Mm -hmm. Like, and I mean that level of thought. Like, I don't want to just get stuff that I want. Of course, I'm thinking like, if I'm considering if it for it, myself, then I, it for then I can, you know, I know it's that level of a gift because I know how I am. So, um, but yeah, no, nah, it's, it's, it's dope. I just want to thank God for allowing us to be able to be in this position and you guys, cause if it wasn't for you guys, we wouldn't be here. So mm -hmm. whatever we can do to, to give back, you know, that's what I'm trying to do. And of course the money we even paid for this event itself. Um, mm -hmm. a lot of people probably thought that would have been enough, but nah, you know, I just feel like it just, it never ends. It should never stop. You should always want to be able to give back to someone and pay it for it. I mean, a lot of you guys are coming out your way to come and kick it with us. And it's like it was just a bit of appreciation, you feel me? So I forgot about, that's actually the way I was gonna take. I'm just on here talking to y'all and I miss my dog on turn. Yeah, it's 331 too. But, um, but yeah, anywho, that just want to say all that. I ain't gonna keep rambling, but just appreciate you guys, man. So it's a small token, it's nothing crazy, but it's a small token. Um, and just always wanted to say thank y'all. So um, can't, ready, can't wait to get turned up for this event we got the smackdown live tonight gonna be late. yeah nisha gonna be there helping out and stuff like that i got a couple of the homies helping me marcus devin demon um quentin her brother and my brother-in-law uh you know it's dope to have a team of people around you to help you put some stuff together i didn't mind going to outsource but I always like hey i'm gonna let the homies know before anybody else yeah on our way all right so i'm back on track baby <laughs> Yo, I had to bust, I had to hit that move one time. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of traffic back there. I don't know what happened, but it's a lot of traffic. So I had to give Nisha the camera because I had to get into that, you know, my Jason Statham mode. Yeah, we have to. And um, get into my uh, my bag. But yeah, so, but yeah, no. Um, it's dope to have people around you because I'm always, nowadays with stuff that I'm trying to do, I don't mind hiring people so that mm -hmm. way stuff can run smooth. Mm -hmm. Everybody can feel safe and we can have and you know enjoy ourselves or everything going according to plan. So mm -hmm. my thing is I always let the homies know first, people that are already in businesses of such, mm -hmm. I might get with you like, hey man, you down the whoop de whoop, you know, and I'm gonna get with you before I try to go with somebody else. Exactly. So my thing is that's what's dope about just, you know, having dope people around you and uh, people can never say I never try to offer them. So, mm -hmm. but yeah, no, nah, it should be a dope event. I'm, I'm ready. I'm lit. Um, I think it's gonna be something that's gonna open up doors for us to continue. You know, that's what I'm hoping for. Is like I'm looking in the future. Exactly. I'm already past this event. I'm looking about next year. How much it's gonna cost for the bigger theater? You know, the biggest one because now nah, we can start advertising mm -hmm. way ahead of time. Yeah, it's gonna so be that, good. Yeah, because a lot of people are like, man, I ain't know, man, y'all just a dope. Yeah, know? this is just a trial run, but once we it's a big ass this, trial run, it's super big. <laughs> but as soon as we get everything resolved this time, we'll be able to have you know make it an annual. Week. Yeah, production will be even better. Mm -hmm. Right now, I'm just you know using minimal things because we streaming, so I don't want to go too crazy. Yeah, you know, but um. No, I can see it being something really live and epic. And this is every year we don't go to WrestleMania as ourselves. Mm -hmm. You feel me? So I'm gonna stop rambling though. We're about to pick up the kids and then we're gonna get something to eat. So get back with y'all. Welcome back, y'all. All right, we got copyright music playing, so I'm gonna be real quick. We at uh, thing to get something to eat now at one of the kids' favorite spots because they get to be on the bouncer, play with the soccer ball and all that kind of stuff. And um, yeah, so Bay is over there. So, we're gonna eat because copyright is happening. So, get this delicious meal. Okay, got me right for tomorrow. Right here, man. Oh, we on a tablecloth. This is live. Nisha doing her thing, bro. Who is Dion? Who is Dion? Dion's in the clutch. Getting all the stuff together. So, we're gonna get lit. It is the day, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we are getting stuff together right now at home. I'm putting up all this stuff. I got my little checklist on my phone. Get you a checklist, man. It's going to help you be able to remember all of the items and things you need when you're doing an event. Just so that way you can make sure you're not forgetting something. Because those little things be the main ones you can forget, but the most vital and crucial parts of when you're trying to do something. So I'm going to finish putting all this stuff up here. Got my cart, got our banner and stuff like that. Uh, that we're going to have to put the shirts on, um, tripods. Yeah. So 
can't wait to meet some of the some of the supporters and uh we're gonna turn up you feel me a lot of them or they still don't know about the the headphones we got i know i was mentioning the headphones before these are the beats um headphones that me and Nisha got okay cool yeah me and bae wanted to get somebody some whoever traveled the furthest um yeah, like I was telling y'all, I kind of want these, but I want to give them to whoever it is that was supporting us. Just a small token of our appreciation. Here you go, man. And uh, yeah, but gonna get finished. I need to eat something. It's like I want to eat, but then I don't want to eat. I kind of want to, you know, save my stomach until we get there and then turn up. But I know we might be kind of sipping a little bit, so probably just get a, a smoothie for now. A smoothie sounds like it's good, and then we'll have some food later. But setting this up, man, and I'll get back with y'all. So. Let's enjoy WrestleMania. First in the clutch experience watch party at the movie theater sold out for two nights. Let's get lit. Wow. Your boy got the only in the clutch. She was going to say you first. I almost messed up. But yeah, nah. We got the fist on, man. Heading to the movie theater right now, you know what I'm saying? Finna go do our thing, you feel me? Stuff sliding back there. And oh, I need to good. drive. We are on the way, y'all. On the way. On the ways. Today is the day. You know, May took a little longer than I expected. You know what I'm saying? She got to get super cute. But uh, it's all good though. We look cute. It ain't right if I ain't waiting on Nisha. Yeah, speak on He always did that, y'all. Every time. That mug in 3D, ain't it? Come on. That hoe clean. Dog. That hoe clean, bro. Bro. The oh. zoom in. Hey. Clean, bro. Appreciate the camera, man. What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? What's up? How y'all doing, man? We looking how we looking over here, you feel mm -hmm. me? Me and wifey. Uh, heading to the theater again for night two. You feel me? Um, definitely enjoyed myself last night. Uh, it was, it was nice. a lot of fun. Nice uh, little vibe. It was a, definitely a vibe for sure. Um, it, it was a movie. No pun intended. You feel me? But uh, <laughs> literally. Only movie. thing is, um, all the people that we had on there is coming. Uh, because I know some people was like, I thought it was sold out. It was sold out. We only did the tickets for like 50 people and then we extended it to like 70, 75. So, um, but I think what it was is people were, every time we was opening it up, people that had already signed up would go back in there to see if mm -hmm. they got it because everybody was like rushing in there to get it. And so we had like a lot of duplicates. But from my understanding, the event, the Eventbrite thing was supposed to, um, I guess like push out all of the the duplicates. Excuse me, my finger was but in the way. But it was supposed right. to push out all the duplicates. So people, so some people, um, some people couldn't show up because things was going on. And then you had people who put multiple people on there uh, that showed up when they only had themselves and they had their name for a couple of tickets. Mm -hmm. And then um, you had some people that put. Uh, a couple of tickets on themselves and then didn't show up. So yeah, that's tough. why the crowd was looking a little skip yesterday. But I mean, nonetheless, I was cool because the original thought was for it to just be me and Ross. Mm -hmm. I wanted to rent out a movie theater inspired by the homie Hunter. I seen him do a video game thing in there. So I was like, bro, wouldn't it be loud to watch WrestleMania just like in the movie theater? We just had the whole movie theater to ourselves. But you know, so it's not a big deal, but we had fun nonetheless. Uh, the people that was there was really appreciative. They really enjoyed themselves, um, and they were showing a lot of love. And you know, it's just one of the things where I don't be tripping about numbers and stuff like that because it's no biggie to me. You know, we do what we do for you guys. As long as I have fun, I'm cool. So that's all it is to that. But just wanted to kind of uh, address that because I know some people were seeing the the crowd was kind of skimp. 
And, uh, you know, I didn't want people to feel like, oh, man, y'all said it was sold out, and then y'all didn't want to invite us. Because that was the main thing. It's a, it's a lot of people that could have came that didn't, we had to turn away because we assumed a lot of the subscribers was already buying the tickets and that, well, not buying, but got the tickets. So I learned this, this year that next time I do something like this, I'm gonna put a uh, pay, like a, a fee on there, whether it's something. Cause niggas ain't gonna spend no bread sure, right. and not show up. up. Yeah, you're not gonna keep signing up for something if a transaction then came out of your account. Exactly. Um, but because that mug said free, whether I do like a couple of dollars, a dollar, five dollars, ten dollars, twenty dollars, whatever it is, people ain't gonna put no bread out and then not, mm -hmm. or keep doing it over and over and over. And that's what people was doing. People was putting it in over and over again. So. Yeah, but what? I said a lot of people just trying to like. What are you I mean, it, this this just probably was on intentional. Probably wasn't. I've never used event. I don't remember or recall using Eventbrite. I probably have, but I don't know what it looks like on their end. Yeah. So they were probably signing up, thinking they was signing up just for them, and yeah. then some people probably thought they didn't get in and tried to sign up again. Because mind you, we was opening the uh, the Eventbrite every now and then. We would open the access to it. And then we would close it, it would get shut down. So that's the thing, you just never know. So next time I'm gonna put it behind, uh, put a little fee on it so that way we can make sure that people aren't duplicating the tickets and that they actually buy tickets for people that's actually gonna pull up. But we extended the invitation to a few more uh, people that we knew that wanted to actually catch it that was still in Houston. Uh, Ross was advertising that, so shout out to him for that. Um, but I'm cool regardless. I appreciated the crowd that was there. Hell, if it's just me and Ross, I'm cool. But we know some people that flew in town from out of, you know, from, from the States, uh, near and far to come kick it with us and hang out and watch it. It's still a dope experience, bro. Like, I ain't gonna hold you. I don't even want to go back to watching WrestleMania on a regular screen. Like, I feel like I gotta have that level of, like, if we gonna do it, yeah, we, we gotta do it. And again, that's whether it's just me and Ross or not. Like, it's one of them things where I'm kind of down to just kind of keep that tradition Oh, keep that tradition going. <laughs> Do it. Keep it going uh, for the near future. But uh, appreciate you guys, man, for always supporting us, man. Because it's, it's just live to just some of the conversation I was able to have was more personable last night. Because, of course, there was a few of them. But um, <laughs> it was lit to hear people tell you, like, HK and all that, how honored he was to be there. I mean, just his, his energy. Just the energy was dope. You know what I'm saying? And I love that. I love good energy and the right crowd versus the huge crowd of people that just, you know what I'm saying? But either way it go, I'm poop. So about to head there tonight for night two. Night two. Um, we finna see if Cody actually finishes the story. The Rock and Roman did they thing, bro. I ain't yeah, even gonna hold you. Last night that Rock and Roman uh, versus uh, Cody and Seth match was fire and Sammy versus Gunther was to me match of the night until we you uh until they did the Rock and Roman and uh Cody and Seth because man no it was dope as Sammy stuff. and Gunther put on a show. I don't really watch wrestling that much but what I can say is it was really dope yesterday um but yeah it was definitely dope to watch it it was dope to experience it just being there itself was a dope experience. Yeah, it was tough. Got Nisha in on it, man. That's how you know it's live, man. You good? So we getting a little bit of the uh, the setup together for night two. You can't really see it well, but it looks better than what it's showing on my phone. But uh, yeah, we getting ready to do our thing up in here. Everything yeah. set up. My boy Mark is in here. Shout out to the homie for helping us out. Ross being Ross. What's good? What's good? What's good? The man up there doing his thing. You can see him. And what's up, Wade? So yeah. <laughs> A real more chill set up night tonight versus what it was yesterday because everything was running good on the first night, but we cool. We cool, we cool, we cool. Hopefully y'all enjoy the event. It's been live. You can? Oh man, I didn't even know that yesterday, man. Hey, appreciate that. Hey, shout out to Travis, man. He gonna send us some shots. I'll be on service for today too. All right, man, oh, man. Appreciate, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Dang, I wish we'd have that. They, uh, like, they like tequila. What's that mango? Oh, yeah, I'm going to take tequila and then that mango drink you had that yesterday. That mango mojito? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So he drinks it in the manly way, though. Uh, I guess. Uh, that guy, <laughs> how do you know the tabs of what's 
So I just put it um, by the seats where y'all sit, yeah. that light right there. C4. So that'll be uh, y'all's tab for yeah. like y'all's food and everything like that. And then how you. Damn, <laughs> Bro, I wanted to get that. Why did you just walk up on him? It was the, it was the like this. Right, like right. how you get there. Okay. I got you, bro, Travis. Bro. Bro. He really sixty years old. Mine just walked up on him. He forgot he was there. Where are you? You can't roll up on those black nobody. Actually, turn that light off. Of. Okay, my bad. Here. She would have cussed with me. Who would have been up? <laughs> Yo, what's good? Hey, how you doing? Oh, that's good, bro. I appreciate you pulling up, man. Man, for sure, man. Appreciate you. Hi. Nice, nice to meet you. I ain't nobody coming in with a hunt. We doing all this? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it don't matter. Y'all trying to double it up or what? So we'll, uh, I'm getting shot at the ceremony. Is it separate time? Yeah, separate. Okay. Because I'm going to be sitting next. Okay. If, if you want to put my Oh, no. No, no separate. Hold on. Y'all was offering shots. Y'all wasn't. I thought he was. I thought you were. I said we was getting shots collectively as a team. Oh, separate. Oh, no. We were going to be shot later then. That's not how we take it. So, uh, the term. We ever wanted, all we ever wanted. Go and stack it by the honey. This is all we ever wanted. Down the morale.